This thing, this thing's dope. The fact that I can do dabs out of my girlfriend's favorite mug, which probably negates her from being able to use it unless she washes it out that day. It's also just makes it amazing. Yo, I'm Carol Baskin Robbins, and today I'm actually kind of super hyped. So I know we just recently did a Yocan product. We did that, that Yocan I can. I actually have it right here. This thing is like a nice little $60 piece kind of dab rig. And I expressed myself that I felt like Yocan is really good for like beginner dabbers because like their stuff's usually not that expensive. And like you can pick it up cheap if you're just getting into dabbing. But this is, this is like their upper end models type stuff. I think this one retails around 160 and this is the Yocan Black Sip. Just sip back and relax. Eh? Eh? It's, it says it here too. It actually says it everywhere. They're really proud of this one. <laughs> They're really proud of that little motto they came up with. But the reason I'm so excited for it is because they have a lot of shit on the back that says things that interests me, like a consumer. So one of the things it says on the back though, which is really cool, other than the fact that it has like a quick control, which is like just a joystick. You can use a joystick to, to pick what heat you want. I think that's cool. But other than that and like, a large is that you know like boasting about the battery life and how many sessions you can get out of it but it says this it says universal fit fits almost every size and shape cup so this is kind of like a proxy like a like a puffco proxy where like i think this middle part is going to come out and you can put it in anything i brought down a ton of different cups like i got like nine different kinds of cups that we have in our house like we got everything i'm talking about like tumblers to like little mugs and shit danny's and Tinkerbell mug and like a giant Sam Adams thing. And we got an Eagles Bud Light cup. I mean, we got wine glasses. We got this. I got, I got Danny this one time for Christmas, I think. It's a, it's a mug. And we even have one of the lighthouse glasses from Red Lobster. So we're gonna try this in all types of stuff, not just the little cup that it comes with. We're gonna test out the universal fit. And th I think this is cool because ev everyone has cups, right? Everyone has cups at home that they can use this with. Like not everyone has like a specialized glass that the proxy can fit into because it's like, like I know a lot of glass blowers have stuff for the proxy and I'm not knocking the proxy at all because Puffco is an amazing company. They make great products. I'm just saying like this fits in cups. Like you have a cup at home right now. You probably have a cup near you right now because I always have like water near me or something. So I'm, I'm assuming you probably do too, right? But anyway, I wanna try this thing out and see everything you get in the box. We're gonna open this shit up right now. Oh, it opens at the, okay. So this whole thing, I was so confused about how to open this for a second. So this whole top piece slides off like that and inside, you have this, this box. So we're gonna put that down for a second. I have so many cups in front of me. But one more thing real quick, uh, it says it has a ceramic heating chamber. And like a lot of the Yocan stuff I've had lately, like like this I can has like, like a quartz chamber with a little heating coil underneath. And like, that's all cool. But like, I prefer, I prefer a ceramic chamber personally. So I'm excited that this also has a ceramic chamber. It has a little Yocan black logoing on it. It's hard as shit to see. I barely saw it until just now. It's not on one side, but it's on the other. Can you see it? Not at all. Now do you see? Yeah. So find that, I'm sure that's probably the top. So we're gonna open, we're gonna open that up has a little cup shape in there. We're gonna put that down and we're gonna, we have this now, this is what we have now. So there's two little things at the bottom, little compartments. We'll go through those in a second. We're gonna get our main device out, which I think just slides right up, right? Yeah, there we go. It's heavy. It feels well made. It's like real glass and everything. Ooh. Oh yeah, that is, that's a, it's real glass. 
You can just take this part out and use this as a regular ass cup. <laughs> and it's actually cool as shit. And here's here's your device. It's got a little a little stem for for bubbling. Fits right in the top of this glass like that. It has stuff on the top. This is cool, man. I'm I'm excited about this. I'm excited about this. It even has like a little like fill the water to like kind of hear thing. I love this. I just love it. It says sip on the side. It says yo can black. You can legit use this as a regular glass too. You could just take the thing out of the top and use it as regular glass. In here, this was hard as shit to get out, but this is the owner's manual. It's just this big. Here you go, Danny. <laughs> Inside the big box first. We'll do the big box first, then the little box. I think the big box is actually gonna have parts. The big box has parts. Okay. A lot of shit actually is going on in here. I know what some of this stuff is, but I don't know what all of this stuff is. Okay, number one. We got a little bag of small turp pearls. I know what that is. Number two, we have Q-tips. I know what that is, that's for cleaning. We have a USB type C charger. Now we're gonna start getting into the stuff that I'm not so sure about. We have a metal straw. Mouthpiece. Got you. We also have a little tool, which I think can fit right in here. It does. This little tool fits right in this little slot. I had a little slot right there for this tool. That's cool as shit. Okay, now in here we have more stuff. It says to be careful with this one because this is glass. Mm -hmm. This comes off there. This little glass piece. I'm assuming this slides up in here. Boom, like that, right? How far down does it go? Is it? Is it all the way? I think I got it. It feels it feels secure. <laughs> now in here there's like anti-slip pad. An anti-slip pad. What does that do? Is that for the bottom of the cup? I think this is literally just for the bottom of this cup. So you can put this on the bottom of the cup so, that, so your cup doesn't slip around. That that's pretty cool actually. I like that. And it makes it so like when you put your cup down, it's it's nice and padded in silicone. You don't have to worry about it. Honestly, this cup looks like the same size as this Eagle's cup. Yep. So that we already know these two are both gonna work. So that's pretty cool. <laughs> Cause these are like the exact same dimensions. That's actually awesome. <laughs> Good to know. I, I can dab off my Eagle's cup. Oh wait, there's also other shit in here as well. I didn't even see this. I didn't even see this stuff. There's a little warranty card and I think stickers, a little sticker kit, a little sip sticker, a little Yocan Black sticker if you want to sticker bomb something. That's cool as shit. All right, now I'm assuming since that's everything in there that I'm assuming this is going to be our atomizer. It has to be because otherwise they forgot to send me one and it won't work. <laughs> so open here, this is our atomizer. Okay. <laughs> it does say that it comes pre-installed on here. <laughs> it does? Yeah. It does not come pre-installed, but that's okay. So don't be alarmed. So don't be alarmed if yours doesn't come pre-installed like it says in the instruction manual because we got one right here and it is a nice shiny quartz bucket. I should probably take a close up so you guys can see before I use it. Huh? Quartz? I mean, sorry. Ceramic. Like the shiny kind of ceramic though. Which makes me think of quartz. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. It's one of those bad boys. Just a little, a little shiny ceramic. Like the polished ceramic. That's what it's called, right? polished ceramic. Oh, also, I realized something. So this is just gonna screw in here, right? Bing, bang, boom. Like that, we actually have to take out, we have to take the straw back out because this part, this is like the little cap for the thing, but it also has a part that goes through where the straw goes. So we need that. So we gotta put the straw back, back through. Boom, now we have it actually set up correctly. Oh wow, and it went way farther in. Way farther in that time. <laughs> all right, whatever. It works. We're in there now. It's all set up. We can fill it up with water and, and take a hit, right? We can finally do that. For today's video, we got this. This is 
Forum mm -hmm. Cookies Runts Cured Resin. It's four grams, which it's gonna have to be because I feel like we're gonna take a shit ton of dabs today. We're gonna try it in all these cups. We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna try it in all these cups. This is gonna be one of like the wildest slow-mos ever. I guess we just, we just gotta get into it, right? Cheers. It's like a literal cheers. Oh my god, it looks so good though. Yeah, it does. All it's supposed to That wasn't bad though. Shit worked. All right, let's um try in a different one. I mean, I guess you could. It's just not gonna look as good. All the airway paths are still in here technically, but I'm gonna skip this one because I don't think it looks good enough. Speaking of that, I don't think the... I mean, we might have to do this just because it's a red lobster. <laughs> this is too big. It makes me think this probably would be too big too. I feel like it's gonna keep sinking. What if it's right on top? I don't know. Who thought this giant thing would be terrible to pour from? That's pretty cool. They want to say my name, but they hold him back. They want to say they hate, but they know it's can't What's next? This one. <laughs> that barely was anything. I can't see how far down it's going. Yeah. Oh, it's touching though. We're gonna have to do some dry. Uh, no, now it falls right there. He's too big. Too big. <laughs> but while we have his bottom out, now we're trying to test on the dry function too. That actually fits so good. <laughs> like memories after death to be a legend instead of something you can forget. I'm living up every breath. I'd rather leave them be led. I'll fill the seats as I spread. That works extremely well. <laughs> This is the second hot, uh, the second lowest, I think. This is up on the uh, up on the D pad. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that! How cool is that? That's the coolest shit. I wish it fit on my tum on the tumbler, on this. You know what I mean? Cause like, oh shit, that's still going. Cause like, if that was on top of this, like that would just look like how it came. Yeah. I need like a bigger one that fits on this. <laughs> like legit. This thing's literally the coolest. And it has RGBs in there. Somewhere, like somewhere under here, there's RGB lights. I don't, we can't really see it because of all the light, all the lighting, but I saw, like I swear I saw RGBs. The cube died. Damn, the cube died, oh no. Oh, this thing, this thing's dope. The fact that I can do dabs out of my girlfriend's favorite mug, which probably negates her from being able to use it unless she washes it out that day also just makes it amazing. I love this so much. You can literally do dabs at anything. I wish it came with more than one coil. I always say that every company is doing it nowadays, but like even like the higher end companies that you're spending, you know, 200 plus dollars to get a device, like they're giving you one coil and they're sending you on your way and then they're charging the shit out of you for more coils, which I 
fucking hate, but I do like this device. I think it's cool. I like that I got to like try it out of all these different cool glasses. I can use, like, I have another Eagles glass coming. I don't know if it's gonna fit that because I think it's more like this shape. You know what I mean? I think it's like more this shape than this shape, but I can use it in this Eagles glass or in the Eagles games, which I think is cool. And I like the fact that on the bottom, there's this little stem, right? This is, this is your water function stem. So if you're using it in something like this, that's nice and tall, you can, you can have this stem nice and, and tall and use in water. This thing actually extends like this far, depending on how much water level you have. And it, it goes really short too. I don't know if you'd actually be able to use a water function with it that small, but it goes really short too. But it also completely comes out. So if you want to use it in something like this and do dry hits, you can just pop it right in there and not have to worry about about the glass stem at all and you can just use do it do it dry hits i fucking love this thing i think it's the coolest thing <laughs> so all right i forgot to tell you guys how to use it so i should probably do that first of all you just snug it in into your favorite glass that you want to use tinkerbell then it has like this is like your little carb cab it's got like this little tab right here i thought that was the top that opened it's not i think it's just to like help you pick it up, but that kind of like, that can slide around. Underneath there's your little chamber, a couple turp pearls in there, I put two. It's kind of a tight fit with two, but I feel like two is a good number. It has this like little joystick control, and it basically just goes around in a circle for temperatures. The lowest temperatures to the left, and then a little bit higher is up, and then a little bit higher is right, and then the highest is down. And they're all different colors. One's blue, green, and then red, and then like a white, I guess, kind of color. It, it goes in order like that. I've been hitting it on the green, and it, it's been it's been pretty nice to me. It's good flavor, I like the ceramic coil. Okay, so I don't know where we're gonna fit this in, but no other channel will ever tell you this about this. I guarantee it, because it's not in the instruction manual <laughs> anywhere. I've looked everywhere. Literally, I've looked online. I went to Yokan's website. I went to their, their website that they have specifically just for manuals, like just all their products manuals. It wasn't even in there. I had to contact Yokan directly and ask them about this. Also, you notice this isn't a, a new thing. This is, this is like days later. It's been days, by the way, since, since we recorded this video, but I, I started putting in this Yeti thing because we take it on walks and I think this looks super legit and it fits in here perfect. But anyway, Anyway, not what I was going to say. And now, slight cut because I have water in my ear. What is love? Sorry, I had, I had water in my ear. Still might have a little bit, of, I don't know. Anyway, the, the power button and the, the joystick, if, if you will, if you click it three times, it'll either flash cyan or yellow like 10 times. And we had no idea what it did. We, like I said, we looked everywhere. So finally I contacted Yokan. Apparently yellow is power saving mode and blue is performance mode. So if you're like at home and you don't really care about your battery life, you can throw it in performance mode and get like a better dab. Or if like you're taking it out and you wanna make sure it's gonna last your whole trip, you can put it in power saving mode. I'm not real sure what power saving mode does, but we, we have tested it and it does seem to last longer. <laughs> I don't know if it has like an auto cutoff maybe, because I don't, I feel like we haven't had to turn it back on. I don't know what it does, but it apparently it's power saving mode. So I mean, it, it, it uses less power, but you will, you will not find this information anywhere else. I've scoured the internet. No other reviewer will tell you this. You, if you know this, it's because you learned it here or you, you yourself hit up Yokan and asked because you also found this and didn't know what it was. So. Just saying. Back to the video. I like I like the glass, the glass thing here. I feel like when I first started using it, it smelled like brand new shoes, and that's a nostalgic smell for me. And I like that. If you know what new shoes smell like, it's a good smell. Weird thing to say, but you know what I mean. <laughs> comes with this little metal straw. I don't know if I mentioned this yet or not, but it comes with this little metal straw. Uh, if you don't like the glass straw, you can use the metal one. Or if you break, God forbid, you break the glass one, you can 
always revert back to the metal one, which will not break. You don't have to worry about that one breaking at all. And it's got this little thing on over here on the side for your dad. So it's like a little container. Like all your stuff is right here in, in this little setup. You got your dad tool, you got your controller, you got your carb cap and, and atomizer right there. It has aimed airflow so the turp the turp rolls will spin around in there, which gives you better flavor too. And the joystick's fun to use, I'm not gonna lie. If you grow up playing video games like me, you like using joysticks, it, it, it has nostalgia. It's five clicks in on the left stick to turn it on and off. I already told you how to set the temperatures. Two clicks starts it and two clicks will stop it. And that's really all there is. It's also got a little USB-C port on the top for charging. That, that's cool as shit, man. I like that. <laughs> I like this a lot. This is like probably my favorite Yokan product. I'm not even gonna lie. I've had, I feel like the Rex was my favorite for a long time. I really like that. And then the Orbit, I still use the Orbit all the time. Specifically just the top of it. I put it on a different, a different battery and I, that has an MP3 player and I just, I use it all the time. That's also one of my favorite Yokans, but I feel like this, I feel like this is gonna be fun to f around with a lot. And like try different glasses and see which one hits the best. This thing hits surprisingly well. <laughs> this is a fun one. I like this one. I'm sad that he didn't fit in a couple. Sad that he didn't work in my Red Lobster Cup. I want to use him in the Red Lobster Cup anyway, even though he doesn't fit. What? Yes, I got some of it. It did not work. This cup failed us. It didn't seal off properly. I couldn't get a hit. Wasted my day. <laughs> it's cool. We have so many. This is this is four grams, and this shit is delicious. Holy shit. Anyway, this is the Yokan sip. Yokan black sip. Imagine just sitting back in the morning and you got like your cup of dabs. You know what I mean? Just chilling. Comes with a handle. This might be our new dab setup, Danny. I'm sorry. <laughs> the handle's perfect for dabbing. It's okay, because that's actually my second favorite cup. Dun dun dun. What? Anyway, I think it comes in at, I think it comes in at like 160. Which I mean, not not shabby, I think. For what it is, I think it's cool. I think I think it's worth it. One thing I, I don't like about it is like, for a product that has like so much going on. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention like a ton of shit about this, right? So there's like a lot of like kind of dumb shit on here that I, don't, I feel like doesn't need to be. Where's the back of the box? The back of the box was even better. But it does have some shit that I'm like pretty, pretty, like excited about. So it has, it has RGBs, even though we couldn't really see it because of like the lights and stuff, but there's RGBs in there. Instant heat, it's basically instant gratification, like heats up really fast, enhanced clouds and smokes, blah, 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 shit like that. But this is the one that got me. It says smoke OS, <laughs> intuitively effortless simplicity. Intuitively effortless simplicity, I don't know. I mean, I guess that makes sense, but it sounds like they're trying, they're trying really hard. But it's, it, and then it says greatest hits, the most popular temperatures compilation. By the way, those temperatures are as follows, which honestly, the I was hitting the lowest one and second to lowest one, and they were both really nice. It's 490, 510, 530, 545, so increments of 15 degrees. But then under here it says, under that it says, annual USB-C updates. But then in like the instruction manual, it doesn't really mention anything at all, basically. It does have like a QR code. Maybe we could go to the QR code and see what the f that says. You know what, we're gonna do that. We're gonna, we're gonna go down this rabbit hole real quick. There's two QR codes. Like this one. No, this just took me to their website where I can buy one. If I click learn more, Will that take me to an owner's manual? No, not really. I guess they're saying you don't really need an owner's manual because of how easy it is. But also, like, I feel like owner's manual is also, like, sometimes say, like, you know, like, cleaning and shit like that. And do's and don'ts. And little do's and don'ts and, like, what's okay and what's not okay. This does have some stuff. It has, like, measurements. It also lets you know the difference between um, a man's hand and a woman's hand. What? In inches. So that's helpful information. I think that depends on the person. 
Uh, it's average, Danny. Right. Get it together. Got you. <laughs> Why is that in this page? <laughs> it also lets you know it's, it's, it is a high quality safe buy. Like, you're good to go. I don't like that they put the safe buy thing in there because that makes me think like, why are you telling me that it's that that it's safe? But Yokan is like, they, I've, Yokan has been sending me stuff like forever, and I've never had a problem with them. And every time something happens, they're like quick to respond and like get me out something new. Like I've had things break on me in the past. Like even after like a long time, I'd be like, hey, like you know, the Rex was one of my favorite products, and then it kind of pooped out on me and they'll be like, ah, I'll send you a new one, no problem. Like, so, I mean, they're really cool to me. But I mean, also I help promote their products, so I guess it makes sense. Anyway, that's all I got for you guys today. The fucking, the sip and, and the cup that comes with it that has like a line on it for like, hey, you can fill it to like around here type deal. And it comes with this like nice little bottom thing, but it fits any, any, any beer glass basically, or mug or, Wine glass, like, shit is dope. I'm, I'm babbling because I'm very high right now. So I'm just going to go. Oh, also you can find this at yocanblack.com. I was ready to say that. Sorry. <gasps> yeah, I had the straw cap out when you're doing that. <laughs> You can't just sip it, rip it.